Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today Jazzy's going to show you how to get personalised plates on your police cars because we all know we can't just put them on there. Alright, straight into the video. You will need an arena vehicle with your personalised plate already on it in your facility. Alright, now it doesn't have to be a Yankton or a modded car. We are just pulling the plate and yes, you will lose this car. From there guys, you want to go and call out your police car that you want to put your personalised plate on. I am going to be using this undercover police car. This is working for the bottom dollar bounties, the new update, but I am just using an older car because I need a plate on this motherfucker. So from here guys, drive it into your bunker and we're just going to park it over here. Alright, just up on this little concrete slab here like that. Now, once you've done that, you just want to make your way outside and job teleport down to your facility, wherever that may be. Once you get to your facility, just walk in. And from here, you just want to run over to your arena vehicle. I have my ISI in here. You just want to stand next to it. And what we're going to do, guys, is pull up your phone, go to, not that job list, go over to quick join, go down to contact mission, and start it up alone all right now the aim of the game here is guys we need to wait for any job to start up and once you see it come up with the population you know how it says two out of four three out of four bullshit as soon as you see that we're going to reopen our phone and restart it right now go to quick join contact missions contact mission and then back out now hop into your arena car and just drive it out now you'll know when you've hit the glitch because your car will disappear straight away as soon as you come out. This is perfect guys. Now from here you want to job teleport back to your bunker. Now as you will notice my bunker has disappeared off the map. Do not worry if your bunker is still on the map. That doesn't matter. Just job teleport over to where your bunker is. Now, my bunker's a little bit far from this job, so I had to steal a car and just drive over there. Do not call out any cars, all right? You want to just make your way over there in a stolen vehicle or run if you can, whatever. But anyway, guys, straight into your bunker. Now, when you walk back up to your car, you will notice that the number plate has not changed yet. That is fine. As soon as you hop in, guys, that's when the magic happens. Boom, just like that, we get our personalized plate. Let's fucking go. Now, from here, guys, easy. Just drive it straight into the back of your MOC to save it. And that is it. She is saved. She has the new personalized plate. But we also have another, the original copy still back from wherever you called it out from. Mine was in my B2 nightclub. So I'm just going to head over there now and show you what to do with that. If you want, guys, you can keep it. You can go and make more copies of it, put more number plates, do whatever the fuck you want with it. But I don't want it because it hasn't got my plate on it. And this is my car. I made these colors. I would like my plate on it. So all we're going to do, guys, there's the original. There's the new one. Easy. Just put your new one down a level so you don't mix them up. I'm going to pop it into B3. And what I'm going to do here is just put an elegy straight on top of this original one with the shitty plate. Make sure you put a yellow elegy too, guys. It has to be a yellow one. No, I'm fucking with you there. Any color will do. And bye bye piece of shit that is it guys we are done job done hope you enjoyed today's video guys make sure to smash that like button if Jazzy helped you out guys it only takes you two seconds won't cost you nothing just hit that thumbs up so I know that this video helped you see you in the next one let's go